Welcome back, everybody, to another All Things Nerd video. As always, my name is Nathan. Welcome back to exploring the world of Azeroth in World of Warcraft. Today's adventure leads us to Grim Batal, the dungeon in the Twilight Highlands during the Cataclysm expansion. Now, before we begin this video, I want to give a really cool and quick shout out to another YouTube channel who goes by the name of Jedi Warlock. A lot of you might know him as the... Um, He's also very active in the World of Warcraft community. He does a deep dive and lore theory videos on WoW. Really cool guy. Had a, Just had a chance to talk, have a long talk with him and got to meet him. And he's just really chill. Uh, if you haven't checked out his channel, I definitely encourage you to do so. I'll put his channel in the comment section below and the description. So go give him a, a, a sub. Give him a follow. Check out his videos. Go write something encouraging on his, on his videos and uh, definitely go check out his channel. Great guy. Um, love talking with him. And uh, I know that uh, he's uh, will really appreciate if you stop by and check out what he's doing over there with WoW. Now, the second thing I want to mention is that this glitch today goes full credit to uh, True Hero. If you haven't met Hero, he's always hanging out in the Discord channel in ATN. And uh, go say hi to Hero. Great guy as well. Good friend. And uh, and also join the ATN Discord channel. It's been a lot of fun in there. We've been breaking out of bounds. We've been sharing different theories. We've been uh, discussing different fun things, taking pictures, and uh, yeah, just having a good time in there and uh, laughing and getting to know everybody has been so cool. And uh, I can't wait to keep growing as a community in all things nerd. So anyways, let's get to the video. As I said before, we're in Grim Batal. And uh, we're going to be breaking out of bounds, and this full out of bounds video goes credit to Hero. So what we're going to want to do is, uh, after you had come into the dungeon, the dungeon portal entrance is right over here. You're going to make your way across the broken bridge over here. And if you're playing the Demon Hunter, it's easy. You just double jump and glide over. You're going to want to come to about right here on the map. And as you see, right above me is a uh, you know building sticking out of the wall here. Now, what's cool about this dungeon is Hero actually found out that you can jump on top of these things. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put my cursor right up here. There we go. So, we are officially on top of this building. Now, once we get up here, we're going to want to make our way to the bridge over here because we're going to be getting out of bounds over here. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to double jump, glide, and we're going to jump on top of here. Woo! No! I fell. Okay, we're going to have to do that again. <laughs> That's okay. Let's do it again. We're here to have fun, right? We're hanging out. So you guys get to stay with me for a little longer. So what we're going to do is sometimes that does fail. So what we'll do is we'll just come back over here. Uh, oh, I'm in the wrong spot. Let's go back. There we go. We're going to go back over here. We're going to do the jump again. And then what we're going to do is we're going to make our way out this way. And we're going to aim towards more of the left this time. So what we're, we're going to do is we're going to double jump. There we go, we made it. And then we're gonna come out this way. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna cross the bridge. And once we get to the other side of the bridge, we're actually going to stop and change specs because we need the fell rush from the uh, Havoc class. So we're gonna switch over to Havoc. Once we switch to Havoc, I'm gonna show you how to pull, perform this glitch and how to do it. Now, this glitch <laughs> is not super simple. It takes a little bit of timing and um, this is definitely the hardest part of the glitch. So if you want to do this glitch, uh, follow my directions here as it can be a little tricky. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to come over here to the edge. Now we're going to jump out this way. And the reason you're going to jump out that way is because there's a wall right here. When we hit this wall over here, it's actually going to clip us through the wall and we're going to fly out. Now what we're going to do is we're going to double dump, uh, glide, fell rush, fell rush. Ventral retreat. Oh, I almost I ventral retreat the wrong way. That's okay, but I think we're still going to make it. I mean, we're just going to map some more sis out. There we go. We made it. Woo, that was close. <laughs> so normally when you ventral retreat, you want to go the other way. So you're pushing towards where you're going, not away. So oh, that would almost have been a blooper video right there, but we made it out. So thank God. <laughs> oh man guys i have these fun moments with you guys on this channel i really do oh man as you can tell i'm not perfect either so 
All right, so now be careful when you come out here exploring the so-called quote-unquote wetlands. There's not much out here, but there are some cool things to explore. Do not go in this area down here, as you will die. Do not jump off here into here. You will die. This is all death. All death right here. So what you want to do is you actually want to make your way up this way. And um, I find it easier to actually switch back to uh, Vengeance again because you want the Fernal Strike. So what we're going to do is we're going to jump over here. We're going to come up here. Now, you can explore the portal area right around here. Just be careful not to go over here because you will clip back into the portal and it'll take you back into the dungeon. But you see this wall that I'm kind of stuck in right now? You're going to come over here. You're going to put your uh, Infernal Strike right over here on the ground. And you're going to get back out of bounds. Now, you're going to want to follow the path along this way here. So just go along the edge here. And you should be fine. Um, I haven't died over here yet. And you're just going to want to make your way out this way. And boom, now we're safe and we can go explore the so-called wetlands. So as we actually make our way out here, you can see some really cool skyboxes. And actually, we're getting a little closer look at the dungeon from the outside here, which is really cool. But you can see some birds flying around. And a really cool skybox, which is really nice. So they do keep the skybox from uh, Ada, which is really cool. And we're going to mount up, and we're going to go along this way. Now, make sure to stay along this side of the path, because coming over here will kill you. And this is one of my favorite views of this map. You can see the bridge here from Loch Modan is actually in place, crossing over to the wetlands. And it's still broken. So they did use the Kata, I guess you could say, textured version of this map. <laughs> a lot of you know that I say untextured a lot in my videos, but uh, they did use the assets from Kata, which is kind of sad. I, I kind of wish they would have used wetlands, uh, the vanilla version, but I understand. This dungeon was made back in Cataclysm, so what can you do? Now, if you look down here, you can actually see there is a part of the wetlands down here that you can drop down to. There is no water. And a lot of it is just uh, open terrain that you'll just kind of fall into the void and die. So be careful jumping down there. But we're going to head over this way. And what we're going to do is I'm going to show you a really cool shot of this bridge. This makes for really good screenshots, Mez. You're going to get stopped by a wall. And what you can do is just jump right over the wall there. But what we're going to do is we're going to make our way up the mountains here. We're going to see if we can scale the mountain here. We should be able to, oh, if we don't fall. Because I would like to show you what's on top of the bridge over there. Uh, should let us. There we go. Okay, we okay. I thought we had to... Uh, Infernal Strike, but I guess not. Now, this is a really cool view. So as you can tell, normally there's water down here. What's kind of disappointing about this map is I wish they would have kept just a little more out here. It would have been cool to explore the wetlands outside of the map and also Loch Madan. But, of course, can't always choose what we want, can we? And what we're going to do is we're going to make our way up this way, I hope. And then uh, we're going to make our way out that way. So I guess we're, what well, you know what we should do is we should switch back to uh, Havoc here so we can use our Fell Rush to get over there. So I'm going to actually wait for another charge because it's on cooldown. And once we have that second max charge, we're just going to start flying over. So we're going to head out this way. Ooh, okay, we made it. There we go. We got on top. And as you can tell, there is some of Loch Madan over here. And you can actually see what's behind this bridge over here. We're going to make our way up this way. Uh, if we don't suck. Uh, okay. Just All right, we're just going to cheat it. Forget it. We're going to come up the little hill here. As you can tell, there's not much up here. And I know what you're all thinking. Can you go on the bridge, Nathan? Yes, you can. It won't fall, You won't fall through or nothing. But for the sake of the video, I want to go explore more this way. Just to see what's over there. But I do want to give you a cool shot of this bridge, so...
So we're actually going to continue out this way and go see what's back here. Now, I haven't been out back here yet. I have explored the bridge area and all that already. So I will be honest with you. But you know what? Actually, let's jump down there. Let's go take a look. I'd like to show you guys what's back here. There isn't too much. But as you can tell, it's just kind of the edge of the world. And the uh, edge of the map just kind of cuts off. You know what? Let's do it. Let's go jump on the bridge. Why not? I'm curious to see if it's going to... No, it doesn't. Okay. I was going to say I was curious to see if it's going to, you know recognize us being in a building and dismount us but i guess not now we need to get back up on the mountains because i want to show you more out that direction to see what's kind of out there we might even hit a death wall to be honest with you um trying to think how we can get back up here because we have jumping down oh there is a random box out here with dynamite There we go. All right, we're going to fell rush. And I think we can scale the mountain here. Yep, we can. And I want to get back up over here, but I don't know if that's possible. We could try. We're almost to our second fell rush. There we go. Nope. All right, we lost it. That was sad. Let's see if we can make our way out that way. We're going to do a little bit of maneuver in here. We're going to wait for our second fell rush again. But I think we can make it up here. Or maybe not. All right. Never mind. I lied. I'm not going to do that again. <laughs> I thought maybe we could make it. Can we use the tree? No, I can't use the tree either. It's the only sad part about coming over here. You get stuck pretty easily. All right. Let's see if we can scale over here. And we can't. So I think we're just going to have to accept defeat and see if we can run around the mountain again. But let's go out this way. We may be able to do something with this here. There we go. We can get on top of here, get on top of here. And maybe get back up here this way. I don't know if this is going to be possible. That's pretty high up. Uh, this is kind of tough. The only way I'm maybe thinking is come over here and then make our way up the mountain here. But uh, I shouldn't have jumped. I was in a good spot there. Oh, that's sad. Well... Sadly, I might just need to end the video here because <laughs> I don't know if I can get back up this mountain without having to walk all the way around and I don't want you guys to just sit there and watch me walk around the whole place again because I think there's a bunch of death walls over there anyway so we can't really explore that side. But anyways guys, I'm going to end the video here. This is what's outside of Grim Patol. If you want to go check it out yourself, uh, make sure you don't vengeful retreat backwards <laughs> like I did. And uh, just have fun with it. Um, make sure to join the ATN Discord. Check out Jedi Warlock's YouTube channel. I know he would appreciate the support. He's been a growing YouTuber as well, starting his journey off there. And he does really cool lore and theory videos. So, anyways, guys, as always, my name is Nathan. I'll catch you on the next video. Take care.